Flower. Good evening, this is Bell Geode, and we are back with some Digital Combat Simulator. That's DCS World. Okay, so tonight we're going to amp everything up a notch. This mission is called Taking Gudada, and it is actually going to be part one of a two-part mission. Now, the original mission I downloaded from the DCS website, it was just called Gudada Bar Cap. Um, obviously, I've modified it so that Tiger Squad can use it. And I think I actually uh, went a little bit overboard on this one because I also included an MI6 flight that is going to actually help to take the airport. So that's going to be our part two. I will actually manually fly that one for part two. So for part one, we're going to do some air superiority work. So let me read the description real quick here. Our forces are going to retake Gudada from Georgian control. The operation consists of a ground assault headed by armor with support from Su-25T strike aircraft. For the mission to succeed, air superiority over Abkhazia is required. I'm assuming I'm pronouncing that correct. If not, don't hit me. <laughs> okay, so we are back with Tiger Squadron. I, of course, I'm going to be flying as Cherony Rossi, and I will be call sign 110. Crazy Ivan is going to be to my left, and he is going to be call sign 111, and Bad Boris is going to be call sign 112. You can't really see him back there because of this little briefing window. We will have a tanker on station should we need it, and there's also going to be a second flight of Tiger planes that will be taking off approximately 10 minutes or so after we leave. So our task is going to be to secure the airspace over Gudada to give our ground forces the highest chance of success in retaking the airbase from Georgia. Our flight is going to be relieving a pair of MiG-29s that have been on CAP over the base. CAP stands for Combat Air Patrol, which is pretty much what we're going to be doing as well. Once air superiority has been achieved, we can call the uh, 25s in and that task is left to us. Okay, that's pretty much all that I need to read on that. That gives you a basic idea of what we're in for. And as you can see, the weather sucks. Kind of reminds me of that one mission I did, the power station. Yeah, this is not going to be a very fun trip as long as we are underneath this cover. All right, let's go ahead and get started. The sooner I can get this one done, the sooner I can move on to the MI-8. Okay, time is of the essence. We still have the Turks, and they are still in Vandal Squadron, as well as F-5s and F-4 Phantoms. So we're going to want to get out of here as quickly as possible, because there's a whole ton of planes that need to be taken down. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and call for clearance to start up. Okay, there we go. Go ahead and put the flaps down. And while I'm spooling up, I'm going to go ahead and request permission to take off. Wow, look at how I'm rocking back and forth. This deck is crazy. Holy crap, landing on this sucker is not going to be fun today. I can just tell. Okay, we're pretty much set to go. Let me take a quick look at the map. Okay, you are currently hearing these two guys. These are the MiG-29s. They are trying to keep our boys alive by taking out these two Su-25s that belong to the Georgians. As for us, um, well, we've got some company in coming here. I'm sure you can see them. Let's go ahead and launch. 
Alright, spooling up. I just want to get over this cloud cover because this is just, ugh, this is nasty. Okay, we're good to go. What the hell, Ivan? We haven't even taken off yet. Give it a rest, buddy. Minimum Cody. speed. Minimum speed. Come on, baby. Minimum up, up, speed. Up, 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 up. There we go. That's a good girl. All right. Well, as soon as Ivan and Boris take off, we'll go ahead and turn around. Let's see if we can get out of here. Nice, looks like the MiG Splash 1 Bandit. There's only one left. Alright, both of my wingmen are up. And it's time to get above this cloud cover. Maneuvering is going to be a pain in the butt as long as I'm under it. Mm, this should be it. Yep, there we go. Go ahead and turn the RWR down. And we're going to make a nice left hand turn here. So that we can get on track. The boys will just have to catch up with me. What the hell? What's tracking me? A plane? Already? What the hell is tracking me? Huh, must be that SU-25. Didn't even think he could see me. Okay, where are my wingmen? Okay, there's one. And here comes Ivan. You may notice that my labels have actually changed colors. I couldn't stand the red and the blue, so I actually am going to be making all friendlies, friendlies being Russian, purple, and all enemies, um, olive green. That's my new default colors for my labels, so hopefully it should work a little bit better for me. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and kick in the autopilot. And I knew that was coming. What is he tracking now? Hold on, let me check the map here. Oh, he's tallying these guys, the F-5s. Yep, that's definitely Turkish F-5s. This guy's flying like a wobbly goblin. What the hell, man? And the lag is real. Okay, my wingmen are in position. I see one. I don't see the other. That's alright. I'm still going to tell them to turn on their radars. And while you guys are at it, go ahead and turn your jamming pods on, please. I should probably do that myself. Okay, see the green flashing light? Should go solid in about ooh, five more seconds, thereabouts. There we go. Alright, good deal. 
So, what we want to do is we want to get to that first waypoint. Since this is a cap, a combat air patrol, I kind of want to hit my waypoints. Um, if we are getting encroached upon by the enemy, then that will have to go by the wayside. Right down there, you can see on my radar on the right hand side there, that's actually an airstrip that rectangle at an angle. I believe that should be Gudada. It's either Gudada or Sukumi. I think it's Gudada yeah. though. We're about to get really hectic. Now, as far as the two-part mission goes, how I'm going to break this up for this particular portion of the mission, I just want to achieve air superiority. So that means we're going to need to down those F-5s. We're going to need to down the two F-4 Phantoms that are going to be taking off from Kutaishi soon. And we're also going to need to down the two F-16s from Vandal Squadron. Those guys are aces. So they will probably be the hardest of the bunch. Alright, Ivan has got a tally on a bandit. I see nothing. I'm gonna switch it to radar. Or to air to air. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I got this on him, so I don't know how far out they are, so I'm going to set it by default for 70 kilometers. Looks like we got a lock. Okay, here we go. We got a lock. We're good to go. Let's go ahead and take it off of autopilot. Time we introduced ourselves. Greetings, this is Tiger Squadron. Welcome to your death. Okay, I'm in range. That should mean that the other guy should be in range. So let's go ahead and do it, boys. Engage all bandits. And they've got a lock on me. Okay, Ivan's got a lock on him. I'm gonna take the guy behind him. I am in range. I'm just waiting for it to get a little bit closer. Nice going, Ivan. Alright, here we go. Fox 1. I think Ivan and I are shooting at the same plane. Great going, Boris. Alright, I know there's one left. Where in the hell is he? There he is. Oh hell, that's a missile. Don't go chasing that. Come on guys, dodge that. Dodge that. Thank you. Oh, there's the other guy. He's like way the hell over there. Oh crap, what do we have going on here? We've got the phantoms. Who are you shooting at, Ivan? Oh, you're shooting that last F5. Okay, cool. There he is. Okay, I've got him locked up as well. 
We need to keep an eye out. That's our tanker. Okay, looks like Ivan was no joy on that missile. Oh, I'm looking out for those other suckers. Alright, I'm gonna fox one this guy. Come on, baby, hit. Flashing on my radar, that's a good sign. Let's switch to missile view. Boom, flower! Yes! That's what we were waiting for. Okay, so that takes care of the F5s. Come on, guys, back in formation. Alright, let's see if we can find these other suckers. There they are. I shouldn't need to tell them to engage again. But just to be on the safe side. Alright, good going, Boris. I'm glad to see he's on the ball. Ivan, you need to get with it, buddy. Okay, let's go supersonic here. I am just in range. I've got launch authorization. I'm locked up on the left guy from the looks of it. I think Boris is going for the right guy. I don't like that they've got such a good lock on us here. Right. You take the shot. Box one. Oh boy. Okay, time to get out of this neighborhood. Got this guy. Here we go. Fox one. Come on, baby. Hit, hit, hit. There we go. That's a boom flower right there. Okay, so that takes care of one of the phantoms. What the hell am I reading at? Ooh. Boris got hit. Well, actually, no, that was Ivan. Ivan got hit. That looks to be a missile. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh 
Oh crap. That's Vandal Squad. Alright, Fox 2. Got him! Ooh, baby! How are you doing, Boris? Still alive? He's still alive. Okay. We're still in this to win this. There he is. Holy crap, there's still two of them. Oh, wait a minute, that's the one I just blew up. Oh shit, I think Boris just got hit. Yeah, it looks like Boris just got hit. Fox 2. Got him. Don't worry, Boris. I got revenge on him for you. And what's the verdict? Looks like Boris ejected. Okay, cool. Cool. We're good. Whew. So who do we have left? Because Ivan's heading back. Oh, wow. <laughs> Tiga lead. All hostile aircraft have been neutralized, sir. You may RTB. Not a moment too soon. Okay, so we lost Boris' plane. He ejected, so he's good to go. We'll have to send out the SAR for him. Strike group is standing by, waiting airspace clear message. Well, you should get the message loud and clear. Get the hell in there. Cause a lot of pain. Should be able to see Gudada pretty soon. We're heading straight for it. I just don't see any signs of life. Yeah, there's Sukumi. So, all things considered, the mission went well. We lost Boris's plane yet again, but like I said, we'll go ahead and pick him up. That won't be a problem. Ivan should be pretty much by the carrier by about now. Yep, looks like he is trying to land and doing a horrible job. Dude, your plane looks like ass. You may as well just dump it. The SAR's got to go out to pick up Boris anyway. Might as well have him go out and pick you up, too. Although, today does look like a horrible day for a swim. So wait, who's actually engaging? Oh, you know what? I think that's the MI-8. Let's take a quick look. Yep. That's going to be our next mission. Alright, now we can start seeing the points. Green dots, I'll remind you, are going to be the enemy. Purple dots, as well as purple crosses, are us. Alright, 
Definitely a lot of activity going on down there. But there you go, like I said, that's going to be our next mission, part two of this mission. And there's the MI-8s. Okay, so what do we have here? This is one of our frigates. I haven't you down yet. He's attempting to come down. I don't think he's going to make it. I really do not think he's going to make it. Yep, yep. Call that one. All I know is if he hasn't landed by the time I get there, I'm taking his place. Wow. <laughs> well, that'll give you a little bit of a sneak peek as to what's in store for me when I actually fly that manually. Yeah, I don't think Ivan's going to make it in, so you know what, I'm going to go ahead and turn my lights on. And I'm going to start losing some power. Prepare to come in. I'm about 13 clicks out. Yep, and I can start seeing the boat. Oh boy, this is going to get interesting. Alright, let's drop all power. Okay, now we are set to land. We're gonna need to pull out the speed brakes. I'm coming in way too hot here. Wow, wind is like pulling me all over the freaking place. Okay, tail hook down. Firm tail hook is down. Alright, air brakes up. Flaps down, gear down, speed up. Alright, I got three down and locked. Okay, let's see if it can be done. Ivan, don't even think about it, buddy. You had your chance. He's actually going to try it again. I don't know why you even bother, buddy. What the hell? Turn this off. There we go. I really don't need that beeping in my ear. Oh, 
Ivan, get out the way. Thank you. Appreciate it, buddy. Yeah, trying this without the autopilot on, that would have been a recipe for disaster. As it is, I'm already coming in a little bit low. No, I'm way low. Alright, let's see if I can manually bring her in. Okay, here we go. Here we hope this works. Dropping all power. Wave off. Wave off. No, there's no way in hell that was going to work. Alright, gear up. Flaps up. Gear down. Shut up. Gear down. Shut up. Gear down. Shut up. Gear down. I said shut up. Gear down. Damn you, Betty. Alright, let's switch this back around. Hi there, Ivan. How are you doing? Something tells me all three of us are going to be going for a swim today. Alright, Ivan. If you think you can make it this time around, go ahead. But if you miss, I'm coming in right behind you. Okay, flaps up. Trim down. Gear down. I'm going to go out a little bit further before I turn around since I see on the radar that Ivan's trying it again. And of course, once again, he has failed. There is no way in hell he's going to be able to bring that plane down. He may as well just eject, buddy. Like, seriously, it's not happening today. Alright, my turn. Okay. Now let's see what we got set up here. Looks like I am a little bit to the left. Oh no, I was a little bit to the right. Alright, let's see if autopilot can at least get me on course, and then I'll take the autopilot off and try it again manually. Wish me luck. Okay, looks like we're lined up, and Ivan, what in the hell is on your mind, buddy? I don't think so. That is no bueno. Yeah, you just keep flying. That would be awesome. Just get out of my way, man. Just get out of my way. Okay, we got the green. We got the yellow, too, but we got the green. Damn near forgot the tail hook. Okay, autopilot off. Let's bring this bird in. Pitch down. Drop power. Still way too high on that one. There was no way I was going to bring that in. Alright, here we go again. 
Gear up. Flaps up. Gear down. Gear down. Betty, I swear. I'm Gear down. You. Gear down. You wait till Gear I find down. a way to rip your circuits out. Gear down. 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 Let's just add to the pressure that Ivan is trying to land as well. I don't even know what my gas is. Uh, 3,000. Okay, we're good. Okay, let's go ahead and click in yield autopilot. Like I said, I want it to line me up. But then I'm going to have to take it off and try this thing manually one more time. Oh, good lord. Ivan, seriously? Why don't you hold your position? Negative? Well, dude, I don't know what you think you're doing, but you sure as hell ain't landing. I'm telling you, dude, you're going to have to ditch that. It's going to be a thing. Mark my words. Alright, I'm losing way too much power here. Alright, let's trim this baby down. Okay, here we go, here we go. And we got it. Woo! Wow. Not exactly my best landing, but at this point, I'm just glad to have gotten it on the deck. All right. Do my post landing ritual. Yes, I had the air brakes out for that one. Air brakes in. Tail hook up. Flaps up. Wings fold. And let me get the hell off the deck. Okay, cool beans. Well, that'll do it for this particular mission because I'm not going to sit around waiting to see if Ivan actually makes it in because I know he's going to have to. He's not going to make it in. Wow, what in the hell is lagging me out so badly here? This is horrible. Crap. That was just crazy. Alright, let me get to my parking spot so that way I can call this sucker done. There we go. Okay, left engine off, right engine off, canopy open even though it's raining, and last but not least, power. All right, so there we have it. That is the end of part one of taking Udata. Next up, we've got part two, and I'll try to have that done in short time. That will feature the MI-8, and yes, there will be some close air support involved in that. So as always, I thank you all for watching. This has been Belgeo playing Digital Combat Simulator DCS World flying the SU-33, and next time around, like I said, we'll be flying the MI-8, so be sure to tune in for that. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you've enjoyed what you've seen, and as always, you can find me on Twitch at www.twitch.tv slash belgeode. I do more than just DCS on Twitch. I actually live stream a lot of different games, so be sure to check that out. You can also find me on Facebook. That is Belgio2015 on Facebook, and that way you can be kept abreast of any changes upcoming. Okay, that'll do it for me. So I'm going to sit here and watch Ivan go round and round, and I'm going to bid you all adieu. Ciao!